Naruto reaction. What up? Today we're going to be doing episode 127, and yeah, so last episode, what did we learn? We learned that Tsunade kind of loves Jiraiya. Yeah. We also learned of the name of Naruto's mother, Kushina. Kushina Uzumaki. And we also learned... Wait! Kushina Uzumaki. Okay, Naruto's last name is Uzumaki. Uzumaki. So she had to be married to an Uzumaki for their last name to be Uzumaki. All right, and what's the fourth Hokage's name? I don't know. The fourth Hokage's name is Minato Namakaze. Close. So. <laughs> if you guys enjoy this content, go ahead and comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you want to see all our future uploads. Every Monday, we upload seven episodes for the week on our Patreon. So if you want to binge these episodes before they're aired on YouTube, go ahead and Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Roll that beautiful Naruto footage. Jitsu! Bells. Oh, the bells. Like Kakashi used. I have two bells in my hand. Uh. And the fact that there are only two means that one of us will lose. Very sharp, Orochimaru. Hey, if I get a bell, then I just cannot me <laughs> Fine, but when you lose, you don't bother me anymore, all right? <laughs> yeah, all right, let's do this. Here goes. Nope. Uh, I told you, I win the bet, so you get tied up and you have to stay away from me. Don't just shut up, stupid flat as a board tsunade. What did you just say to me, you Ooh. little brainy perp? Now, now, I'd say that's enough. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> You're hopeless, Jiraiya. How can a ninja keep falling into such obvious traps? Can't help it. Those remind you of Naruto. Lacking a purpose to give you direction. Just watch this. Huh? Oh. Summoning Jutsu. Lucky King Enma. It's the summoning Jutsu. Whoa. In the same way that every man is destined to a different fate, so too is the animal to whom he is entwined. So what animal am I entwined with? Before you can make such a contract, you need to become more adept at infusing chakra and making signs. Right. <laughs> is that the third, uh, found a purpose. Third of Kage? And from mm -hmm. that day on, he began taking his training seriously. Sounds familiar. However, infuse more chakra. Study up on making signs. I must Holy shit. The transportation technique or else. Oh, come on. Will I ever be ready to make a contract? Mm -hmm. Why do I put myself through all this rough training anyway? If I were to have a boyfriend, I'd choose a roaching morrow over a brainy perv like you. Oh. The answer is simple. I just have to become the ultimate ninja, and then I'll sweep Tsunade of her feet. Oh, so now he liked her too. To do, there's yeah. no time to waste. It's so weird how very much alike it is. Naruto likes yeah. Sakura, Sakura likes Orochimaru, and, and then Orochimaru leaves, Sasuke leaves. Yeah. Oh my so god, it's like repeating itself. repeating itself. Yeah. yeah. Concentrate my chakra. Make the seal. Or dog, bird, monkey, sheep. No, wait! There's no telling what will happen if you use the transportation technique without making a contract! Oh, and, and Jiraiya oh. training Naruto, Tsunade training Sakura, and Orochimaru training Sasuke. It's like a weird thing going on. Yeah. Huh? He transformed into another dimension. So he tried to summon and he got transported instead. To where there's frogs. Mm -hmm. Where am I? In Frogland. Oh, Wait! Hold it right there! I, the great Master Jiraiya, will fight! <laughs> um, he was always like that. Oh! Wow, he saved the frog's life! That's the way you do it. Hmm. Uh. 
It's a human child. Uh, are you seriously a talking toad? Mm -hmm. To think that a human would Look, come to Mount Neoboku. Uh -huh. I never thought I'd see it. Wait, what do you mean by that? Welcome to Mount Neoboku. We knew you were coming. The great elder predicted this very happenstance. One day, a human child will stumble into Mount Miyaboku, and I will give that child the power of the toad as well as the prophecy. Hmm. What does the prophecy say about me? You're a perv. Well, I'm afraid <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. What? You don't know? You must stay here in train and wait for the great Lord Elder's prophecy, who did manage to come to Mount Miyaboku after all. That is proof enough that you are indeed the chosen one that the great Lord Elder spoke of. Mm. Chosen one, huh? Mm. Oh. I like the sound of that. Boy. Training here and becoming strong? That's pretty meow, meow. From that day forward, Jiraiya divided his time between Mount Miyoboku, the village of toads, and the hidden leaf village. He oh, spent so the he days of his youth forward. learning ninjutsu and training to become a sage. Sage. However, it was nowhere near as simple as Jiraiya had thought it would be when he first started. Oh, Without a doubt, I've gotten I'm stronger teenager. since coming here, but Tsunade is as cold as ever. Well, not just that. If I was destined to be the chosen one, should my purpose be merely to impress girls? Is that no. really the only reason that I'm trying to become strong? Jiraiya! No. Jiraiya! Is stronger than ever tomorrow. Yeah? The great Lord Elder has summoned you, Jiraiya. Finally, what? The damn. The Lord Elder did? Yes, you must hurry. He has seen your prophecy at last. Who are you again? Lord, this is Jiraiya. Jiraiya. Uh, He's the human child. Oh, yes. Of course. I remember it all now. A dementia my, frog. My, you <laughs> sure have grown. You're the one who summoned him here in the first place, you great senile geezer. <laughs> <laughs> you mustn't refer to the great Lord Elder as a senile geezer. Have some more respect, would ya? Now, now, let's not fight. Spouses must do their best to get along. Listen carefully. So let's hear it carefully. I shall now tell you. I will relate my dream. You, who are singularly pervy, shall become a great ninja. And once you do, you shall acquire an apprentice of your very own. That apprentice will become a ninja who will bring about a great change in the ninja world. That is what I foresaw in my dream. What kind of great change? Either great stability or great destruction, the likes of which this world has never seen. But which of these two, I cannot say. So it's either one or the other. What does that mean exactly? There will come a day when you will be forced to make a critical selection. To make a selection? Yes, and whatever choice you end up making, it will direct the way that this great change is going to go. What must I do in order to make the correct choice? You shall travel widely, seeing all things in this universe. Yes, yeah, pervy books. But great Lord Elder, have any of your prophecies ever not come to pass? No. No, never. <laughs> so the apprentice is Naruto. Well, he's had three apprentices. Or two. So you're going to start traveling, is that right? Oh, yes. did she give something this away? Point in my life, I just can't be a guide to a revolutionary. And I certainly don't know how to make the right choice in my prophecy. Oh, I think what I need now is time to see more of the world and meet different people. I see. So, as foreseen in the great Lord Elder's dream, I'll journey throughout the world and maybe write a book too. It seems that that's my destiny. While Jiraiya journeyed and searched for the meaning behind the great Lord Elder's dream, the state of the world grew steadily more chaotic, and everywhere, people began to suffer great hardships. Here, have one. It's milk candy. Oh, 
Oh, shit! What the hell? <gasps> it's just a puppet. Sorcery! The spell tells me destiny isn't something that you search for. Destiny is something you latch on to when it I appears. scared the freaking piss out of me. <laughs> yeah, it did. Is coming. Come it's on, let's sorry. do something fun. Baby sorcery. Hmm. What's that you're writing, anyway? Just scribblings for now. Basically, it says that writing on the wave of the times can never bring about the revolutionary change that we need to achieve peace. You know, if you really want to change something, change me. Oh. Ooh, I suppose you're right. That does sound like a lot more fun. <laughs> this is fraud! You think I'm gonna pay for something like this? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Hold it right there! I'll take over now. If you want to fight, fight me! Fight me, Danielson! Damn it! How can fate be so cruel? I've worked hard to better my land with what little knowledge I have, all for the sake of my clan, and yet. So this guy's dissatisfied with the way the world is going, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's from the. And what I do there is show Wait, the children just how they can fight back when they find themselves facing a harsh fate. So what? I can teach the children new skills that will enable them to make better choices. Let me ask you, just what are those choices then? Life or death, of course. Those are the choices. I must find the revolutionary who can bring peace to the world. And then make the choice that will get him there. Hey, you up there! You just might be the person I've been looking for. Oh, really? Tell me, how would you bring peace to this world? This world is careening toward an age of war, strife, and sadness. Nothing can stop it. You just said it depends on people's commitment. All we can do is pray and have faith. That's all any man can do in a world like this one. Yep, you're not the guy. This man isn't the one either. No. Sleeps under rocks. Ah, this was just an ordinary village. Why would a shinobi do this? That should be you two. You're from the Fuma, aren't you? Why are you attacking villagers living in peace? You're a shinobi, too. I'm journeying in search of one who will become my apprentice. <laughs> Why waste time on something so tedious? It's destroy or be destroyed. Hmm. In this world, you hesitate and you die. Pretty good. You know that? Can I say something? I don't want to hear it. Just die! Give up, huh? Uh, yeah, about that. Ooh. Oh! As long as we're cursed to live in this world of the Shinobi, there can be no peace. The shinobi wants to keep The peace. great Lord Elder's prophecy Not said I'm destined to train the revolutionary who could at last bring peace to this troubled world. But in all my travels, I haven't even come close to finding this apprentice. Even at that early stage, battles were inevitably being fought between the lands. He had to help. Oh, this is why he finds out Lord Humaral was a traitor. Not yet. Tsunade. We are oh. at war. I must find the revolutionary from the prophecy. I must choose the one who could bring peace to all of us. The conflict that they entered would one day be called the Third Great Ninja War. And afterward, thanks to their exploits, Jiraiya and his compatriots would come to be known as the legendary Sanni. Oh, that's how they became the Sony. Well, everyone, that was episode 127. 
We've learned a little bit about Jiraiya, about the fact that the great sage Toad had a prophecy that he would find the revolutionary that would bring out peace. So he's out there on his mission looking for that one person that he will become his apprentice and will save the, and bring peace to the ninja world. So that is what this is all about. So next episode we will find out if he ever finds the person or if he doesn't find the person or what, what comes about all that. So what are your thoughts? Maybe he finally found it and it's Naruto. Yeah, you think that's when it happens? I don't know. I guess we'll find out, guys, in the next episode. Believe it.